In this video, we're going to look at how to add Morpho fingerprint readers into Identity Access in ACU mode. A professional license is required for this feature. First, we need to create a door and a card reader. To do this, we'll use the door wizard. Go to the Setup tab and select Controllers. Highlight the controller by clicking it once and click the door wizard button in the toolbar. That's the top hat button. Select the controller address you want to add the door to. Select how many doors and readers we want to add. In this instance, we'll select one door with reader in. You also have the option to add one door with two readers or two doors with a reader each. Give the door a name and click accept. This will automatically create the door and card readers, which you can see in the doors tab and the card readers tab. Adding a card reader is enabling the reader port on the controller which the Morpho reader plugs into. Select the Morpho readers tab, then click the green add button in the toolbar to add a new Morpho reader. First, give the Morpho reader a name. Select the device type from the drop down menu and enter the IP address of your device. The device profile is for defining how the reader is going to work. Identity Access has 30 predefined profiles to make setup easy. In this example, the Morpho reader is connected to the controller using a weakened connection and connected to the network by IP. The customer wants the option to either gain access with their fingerprint or a PIN code. For this, we'll select profile number 4, biometric or PIN ACU mode. As there is only a reader in, the location does not need to be set. Tick Link to Weakened Reader. Select the controller drop down and choose your controller. Select the card reader drop down and choose the card reader we've just created. If you plan to use this reader as an enrollment device, tick the box for Use Reader for Fingerprint Enrollment. If iClass cards are being used, tick Reboot Reader after full download. Likewise, if this reader will be used for time and attendance, tick Reader is used for time and attendance. Now click Accept and click Yes to perform a full download to this reader. The Card Reader and Morpho Reader must be added to the group. Go to the Management tab and then the Groups tab. Click the green Add button in the toolbar to add a new group. First enter a name. Select the Card Reader tab and tick the reader we created using the Door Wizard. Select the Morpho Readers tab and tick the Morpho Reader we just added. Now click Accept. Alternatively, double click onto an existing group, select the Card Readers tab and tick the Reader, select the Morpho Readers tab and tick your Morpho Reader. Now click Accept. Thanks for watching. 